going to be doing a ribeye roast or prime rib, whichever you'd like to call it. Get it all dried off here. I'm going to be giving it a good coat in mustard and some salt, pepper, garlic. You want to use quite a bit of salt, pepper, garlic because it is a thick cut of meat. I'll wrap it up, throw it back in the fridge. Now to get the charcoal ready, remove my charcoal divider. I'm using the last bit of a uh, royal oak charcoal. Sometimes I like small lumps for low and slow cook. Sometimes it performs a little bit better. Using my Weber wax lighter cubes. They work great. The price is always good. Now that the charcoal is lit, time to get the olive wood chips in my smoker box. I picked these wood chips up from a company called Humus. I found them on Instagram, figured I'd give it a try. Never used olive wood before. I was kind of excited. And after cooking with it, it's very similar to oak. I'll take a couple handfuls and toss them, scatter them throughout the coals. But the wood chips were a little finer than I usually use, but they still worked nice. Now that the charcoal is ready, tamp it down just a little bit, throw the smoker box in, get my smoking stone put back in. I'm almost ready to throw the meat on. Oh yeah, I almost forgot my drip pan. Just a quick eyeball, see where the middle is, insert the temperature probe, the smoke is just starting to roll nice. Right now my grill is sitting at about 200 degrees. I'll slowly increase the temperature throughout the cook. This is probably going to take about four, four and a half hours. I'll probably end out at the temperature at about 280 to 300 degrees. I'm also using my Weber Connect today. All right, it's been about three hours. I'm gonna put some garlic thyme rosemary butter on this thing. I've been basting it about every half hour. I know some keyboard cooks might say I'm overdoing it, but sometimes you gotta please the people you're cooking for. So I cooked this one to 140 internal. We'll see what it looks like after it rests. To preheat the cooler, I just stick a cup of boiling water in previous. Now that it's done resting, get these strings cut off here. Start getting it sliced up. Boom. 
It's cutting so nice and it's so tender. Darn right I'm using that smoked butter.